It's time for Pat's Pat's Cooking Show! We're making roast beef roll-ups today. What we need today is a pan, tin foil, a knife, we need horseradish, we need cheese, we need <clears throat> roast beef! You also cannot forget the Pillsbury Grands. You want the big and flaky ones. Because they're delicious. Mm. First thing first, you preheat the oven to 350. Now we gotta get the pan and the tin foil ready. We forgot about the Pam! We need the Pam! Yeah! Now it's time for the mini heart attack. Ah! Next, once we put it all out, onto our tray, we get the horseradish out. Now, if you can't get horseradish from real horses, store-bought is fine. Next, get your knife and spread it. Next, you take your roast beef and you put it on everything. Step number next, take your cheese and put it on top of everything too. Now the next part is the fun part. We get to roll all these up! Can't do this one-handed. Now for some next level cooking. Spice up your game by putting a little bit jalapeno cheese on top of them. Now this is a waiting game. Now we put it in the oven. Yum 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 yum. Now, next part we have to make sure that we put timer on for ten minutes. And now we wait. Now I know you're wondering, where's the healthy part in this lunch? It's alright, I made myself a salad. Timer went off, let's take a look. They're not done yet. You know that they're ready when they are crispy brown. Mm. Oh sweet goodness, they're done. Mm. Now you gotta make sure first you, you turn off the heat, you turn off the light, and then you gotta let them cool down for just a little bit. <laughs> well, that's cheesy. <laughs> and that's how you make roast beef roll-ups. Now you just get to eat them and enjoy them. <laughs> Tune in next week when I start making who knows what. Oh.